going to show you how to sterilize solution the third way. Remember, we use the syringe to filter sterilize small volumes of solutions. We use the tabletop uh, filter to sterilize volume of larger solution, uh, larger volumes uh, that cannot be autoclaved. And then now we're going to show you how to use the autoclave to sterilize solution, uh, small volumes and large volumes. So when you come in, the start button is going to be depressed. It's going to be on. All right. The first thing that you check when you come in is you check the water level. And it's sort of like the oil dipstick in your car. You pick it up and you look at it and this is good. There is a maximum level, there's a minimum level. It's halfway in between so it's okay. It, it's, it's safe. If the water level is very, very low, all you have to do is take one of these bottles and pour some in and check it again. But it's always good to check it before you use, okay? The next thing you need to do is you need to open this and you need to fill it with your items that you're gonna be out of play. Let's say uh, we wanna sterilize a few bottles of solutions and so you stick the bottles in there and you leave it open and so you come here and you turn the knob to where it says fill water, like so. And so you open this and you just kind of watch the water and it's going to come out. And it will take it about 45 seconds to a minute. And you just kind of lean down and look at it. And uh, you probably won't see it on the camera, but I can see that the water is coming out. Okay. And you want the water to come up to right before this mark right here. And so you can see through the grids that the water is coming very quickly. And you just kind of hold off and wait for it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so it's ready. So you close this and you turn it to sterile and you put this latch on here on the door and you turn it to your right until it's tight and snug. Not too tight, like that. All right? If you're the first one to begin autoclaving, let's say early in the morning, and you just need to autoclave for 15 minutes and most solutions will be sterilized at 121 degrees centigrade for 15 minutes. But if you're the first one to use these autoclave in the morning, you will turn it to about 55 to 60 minutes to allow the machine to warm up and then it will autoclave for you. Okay, so I'm going to turn this knob like to, to 60 minutes and you let it go. Now, after a while, if you come back, you're going to see that the uh, white clock hand is going to go up to meet the red clock hand. And that indicator is for the internal chamber pressure. Now, when you come back, you're going to see that. And at the end of one hour, that thing is going to begin to decrease. It's going to begin to come back down to zero. Now, don't touch the door as long as you have a number registered with the uh, white uh, uh, minute hand, okay? But if it's completely down to zero, then you can begin to open the door because the chamber pressure is down to zero. But be very, very careful. Once you turn this, make sure you always stand behind the door. Don't ever stand in front of it because if there is enough pressure in there, it might blow out some steam and uh, you'll burn yourself. Just be very, very careful. This is very hot. And always wear safety gloves when you're taking out your solutions. That's how you sterilize large volumes of solutions. Thank you very much.